Okay, today I'm gonna make some strawberry pancakes, so I'm excited. <laughs> Definitely love some pancakes and waffles and anything breakfast, but I think for my setup, I'm gonna try, try making some pancakes. So I've got kind of like stealth mode set up back here. And I'm ready to make these pancakes. I found this, it's gluten free and you just add water. So that's super simple. So I'm gonna give this a try. Got some strawberries. We've got our handy dandy ghee. I really just have these three pans that I use. Um, I have, this one has a lid, but this is a good one for rice or uh, soup. And then I have my frying pan. Uh, it's kind of deep too, so it can do like saucy things, but it's good for like for the pancakes. So I just have these two dishes and um, this bowl for eating, but it can also be a mixing bowl. So that's what I work with. Got the, the stove set up with the canister in it. It's all locked in place and I've got my pan ready to go. And now I'm gonna mix up my pancake batter. Oh, I wanna point out, I um, used some of my <laughs> pillows to kind of level off this, um, the stove. So th those strawberry pillows are really handy. Let's see, I didn't, I I'm not gonna measure it out. I kind of, I think I can gauge the consistency. We'll see how close I can get, but um, I don't wanna make too many maybe like three medium-sized pancakes. Just kind of eyeballing it. I have to say, I know, you know, this does probably save a little bit of money, um, but it's also a lot of work to cook in my car. Um, so it's about the money, but it's really also about cooking. I love to cook. And that is one thing that, um, I'm happy to be able to continue to do um, in my car. I love sleeping, I love watching TV, reading books, and I love cooking. Those are kind of like the things I enjoy about having like an apartment. So um, I could still do all this in my car and not have to pay rent. I'm gonna add a little water and stir it. I realized I had forgotten the maple syrup, so I went into my trunk, dug around a little bit in my food area, and found it. it's time to add the maple syrup and the whipped cream. So I have to say maybe it's because I grew up in New England, but I am a little partial to real maple syrup and it's worth it to me. I love the stuff. 
It is a little pricey, but it's hard to beat the flavor. And I just think it's so cool. It comes from trees and yeah, I love it. So I'm going to put some of that on. And some whipped cream, just because I don't think strawberry pancakes are strawberry pancakes, proper strawberry pancakes without some whipped cream. <laughs> I might have overdone it on the whipped cream. But, uh, yes. Well, let's go. You can see the syrup down there. Some of the, some of them have um, the strawberries in them. There's three pancakes. I think the first one has strawberries in them. The other two I just made. And, oh, I'm excited. I'm about to eat. First meal of the day. So I just think it's pretty cool that I can still do the things I love to do at home. Cook. All the things I want to cook, I can do them in my car. Let's try a bite. <laughs> Amazing. Fully stretch out in my car. Make strawberry pancakes in my car. I can even have my little cozy fire. I think with a creative view of life that most of our obstacles there's actually like more opportunity there's opportunity in the obstacles and it's like do we want to focus on the 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 things that are hard about the challenges or use it as an opportunity to think creatively and find a like another solution to get through and that's not, i mean i i that's kind of how i i have grown to see challenges to quote the wise strawberry shortcake in her episode of the 1981 episode i believe of um big apple city when she goes to the bake show and kind of gets tricked out of the win and she was like you know what she was sad but she was like it's okay because the victories in the struggle so the f she felt like she had won just by like showing up and going through the work and being there and it's a good lesson so <laughs> I'm going to chow down now on my strawberry pancakes before they lose their luster. <laughs> but have an awesome day. Have a great day and thank you for joining me for strawberry pancakes. Mm -hmm.